Ciao, I'm a troublemaker. Ciao, they're troublemakers. <laughs> oh, uh, good one. Yeah, a little bit. No. Uh, no. <laughs> I don't have a hop. Just kidding. Uh, for, for, for me, uh, I would, yeah, to be honest, I would say, yeah, it's kind of hard to miss friends and family sometimes, but. Um, yeah, we're having fun, so yeah, we're having a good time. So. It keeps our mind off of it. It formed in 2008. Um, uh, basically, Ben and I had been playing together in other bands previously, so since we, we were very young. So, yeah, since we were like 14 years old. So then we decided, um, right as high school was ending, to start the Madigans and take music seriously and start going on tour. Later we found Seb over YouTube and he flew to Canada and joined our band uh, three years ago. So that's basically how it happened. Uh, the Madigans is uh, my friends Shannon and Dan from high school. Um, that's their last name and I don't know. We thought it was cool. We thought it was cool. Originally it was she suggested it and we all kind of laughed and we were like that's a stupid name and then like after a while it grew on us we were like actually that's pretty cool. So it stuck. It stuck. Um, we worked on Love vs. Passion for about a year of just like writing songs but then it was only in the last I'd say maybe three to four months before we actually recorded that all the songs uh, were written that were put on Love vs. Passion. It was like we had all these ideas for it and then all of a sudden we're like wait no this song has to go on this song this song this song and so right before the studio it was all kind of put together. Yeah we, we wrote about 30 songs for it and then we picked the we narrowed it down to five in the end so Maybe those songs, the other songs will get used again someday, maybe they won't. Who knows? Yeah. Um, personally, Seb, why don't you choose that song? I have no idea why. It, it's we put, we put, the best we put, we put like a, a status out on Facebook and uh, just asked if we were to be, do a music video, which song. I think that one got the yeah, most it votes. Yeah. yeah, it was it was down to three songs. It was Miles Ahead, Melodies, or uh, Talk This Way. Yeah. Talk This Way was originally supposed to be our single, actually. Personally, we thought that was our single. But then everyone voted for Miles Ahead, and we're like, okay. And we already had like, a lyric video for Melodies. So, so yeah. it just made the most sense. Oh, it's great. Uh, I don't know, there's a lot of really, really good bands in Canada, a lot of pop rock bands that are... That it's underrated. Are, it's underrated, that's yeah. for sure. A lot of very good, unheard of bands that need to be heard of that are from Canada. Oh, we have Mike on tour with us. We have our, our friend Mike. Oh Mike. God! <laughs> <laughs> oh no, he's, I'm on he's, camera! He's half Italian. <laughs> I am half Italian. He's part Italian. Feels um, good to be here. Yeah, and um... Uh, a couple of a new songs. Uh, yeah, new, playing a new song live. Um, We're a, a few months older. Yeah. <clears throat> well, <laughs> uh, no, we, we started writing pretty much as soon as we came out of the studio from recording Love vs. Passion. Just the same, just a few songs. We have a few shells um, and a couple of complete songs. Um, we're planning on recording sometime early next year, but and, and we're gonna hopefully do a longer release. Like yeah, it's gonna be our longest release album. that we've ever done. So. Um, but we don't have any set dates or plans yet, so um, we just, just want to take our time and yeah. make sure it's the best it can be. Mm -hmm. Yeah, essentially November 30th uh, will be the end of our European tour, and then perhaps we'll do another tour. We can't announce details about it yet, and then after that, it's just all hanging out in the studio or demoing for two or three months and then we'll see what happens. Um, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'd say Cartel. Um, Cartel inspires me quite a lot. Um, Love Cartels. What was it? Our, our influences. Inspire, oh, inspire uh, you. Newfound Glory. 
definitely as a drummer for sure. Yeah. Who else in transit love their drummer? Uh, I don't know. There's so many bands. I can't really narrow it down. I have like 20 favorite bands, and every time somebody asks me what's your favorite band, I'm like, it changes. It yeah. changes yeah. every time. But uh, there's a lot of good bands. Obviously, oh, you all know. Reliant K. Uh, yeah, Reliant K. Uh, I just have to say that every time. Every time. Oh. No. Michael wants us to say Kids in Glass Houses because they're pretty cool. <laughs> and Mary has a gun. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>